Hey guys, Undercover Reggie here. Oh man, Iris just told me that you have been lied to. A classic acrophobia move. He's the worst. Well, never fear. This has happened before. Since the beginning of time, villains have used lies to distract superheroes from saving the day. Here, let me show you. When God created the world that we live in, there were two people named Adam and Eve. They lived in the Garden of Eden and they were friends with God. He gave them everything they needed. God told Adam and Eve that they could eat any food growing in the garden except for the fruit growing on one tree, the tree of the knowledge of good and evil. God warned them that if they did eat from that tree, they would die. Well, any enemy knows that every truth can be turned into a big fat lie. Adam and Eve's enemy, the evil snake, came to Eve and he asked her what God said about the fruit in the garden. Eve told him what God said, but the snake told her a lie. He said, you won't die if you eat the fruit. You will know things that you've never known before. Eve listened to the snake's lie and got distracted from the truth. Eve not only ate a piece of the fruit, but she also gave some to Adam. Right away, they realized they had done something wrong. God punished them because of what they had done and made them leave the garden where they were living. At that moment, death and evil entered the world, which we are still battling today. When we remember God's word, we put on the belt of truth. It is the part of God's armor that gives us the power to stand up against the lies that come our way. So when you hear the lie, no one loves you, you can remember the truth that God loves you. Or when you think you aren't good enough, remember you can do anything with God's help. When we suit up with the belt of truth, we will overcome any lie. And with God's power, we can save the day.